And once you and I go into business, we own and operate at least the businesses in our community, what we will be doing is developing a situation wherein we will actually be able to create employment for the people in the community. And here we have Tiffany. Hi. And what's the name of your company that you have, Tiffany? And tell us a little bit about it. Eileen Marion Pastry Studio. Um, it's based in New York. I do custom cakes, cupcakes, pastries, just basically. Do you have a brick and mortar building or is this more of a catering type company? It's more of a catering type company. Okay. I work with HBK and East Harlem. Okay. So it's a, a, um, a commercial kitchen that helps out small and how, like me. How long have you had this business? Um, I started in 2009 from okay. home just for like friends and family and then it just blossomed into something totally bigger. Okay, and Tiffany, I know you're a business owner, and you want to empower those folks out there today. Do you have a business tip that somebody can use so they can do what you're doing and starting your own business? Basically, I use Facebook and Twitter to my advantage. You really got the word of mouth out there, and once people started referring me, I just got more and more referrals and mm -hmm. more and more repeat customers, and then I got um, contracts with different nightclubs mm -hmm. to do stuff with celebrities, so it really helped me out a lot. Okay, so there it is. Using Facebook and Twitter, social media, she has become a catering, baking, pastry making phenomenon here in New York. So you want to make sure that you, what's the name of your company one more time? Eileen Miriam. Eileen Miriam. You want to make sure you utilize Eileen Miriam. Check out the website. Once you change your philosophy, you change your thought pattern. Once you change your thought pattern, you change your, your attitude. Once you change your attitude, it changes your behavior pattern. And then you go on into some action. As long as you got a sit-down philosophy, you'll have a sit-down thought pattern. And as long as you think that old sit-down thought, you'll be uh, in some kind of sit-down everywhere. <laughs>